Alright, so good morning everyone, welcome back to another day of the split mod. Today, we're back to take on and hopefully destroy Mirage, the boss that we saw in the previous episode. And like any boss we've seen in the past in the split mod, it looked amazing and I can't wait to refight it, mainly because the sprite was too damn good, alright? The sprites are really carrying this mod, it's a great mod. But you got to admit, the sprites are A++. So welcome back. Um, today, I thought we could start with a little bit of a hunt for some life fruit. Now, I did a little bit of this, and it didn't go too well, admittedly. So I'm hoping that the second dive will be a lot better than the first one. But yeah, welcome back. Um, yesterday, I asked you to uh, leave me some comments about what you got up to on the weekend. And like normal, it was very, very interesting. This is why it's my favorite question to ask, mainly because a lot of you have some pretty strange hobbies or just like interests that are completely different to mine. For example, somebody yesterday was like, I have a hobby and it's ringing bells. That's right. He rings bells. And as he said in his comment, it's a lot more complicated than like, swinging a bell backwards and forwards, you know, pulling on a rope. And he also said that a lot of different bells in Britain sound different. Now, I actually know this to be a fact because I listened to a really great, like, audio documentary not too long ago about the history of church bells. And I actually found it fascinating. So, um, knowing that there is a fellow bell ringer in the comments down below is actually quite cool. Maybe one day I'll be walking through, um, through a city or a village I'll hear the bells and I'll know. It was a crease of the couch. Also, a lot of you really like camping. That's what a lot of you did on, on the weekend. And then even still, a lot of you were like studying away or like anxiously waiting for exam results. I know uh, today is like A-level day here in England. So if you did A-levels, well done, all right? Because getting the results is the thing to be proud of. Whether you got an A or a D, or you could spell fudge, which is F-U-D-G's and E's. It doesn't matter. I'm proud of you either way. Because, you know what? Going to college, it's hard. It's not easy. Um, I think people forget how hard college and, and university can be. So, yeah. Well done to you all. Hope it all went well. Blah, blah, blah. If you're not from England, which is like 90% of you. You're like, well, I don't know what you're on about, James. A-levels? Sounds like Hogwarts speak to me. Nah, it's a real thing, I promise. <laughs> it's a real thing. Um, and then, yeah, other than that, yeah, it's cool. I love hearing about your weekends. Okay, so the dive for life fruit is also not going very well, mainly because uh, I do not have any glow sticks. So this is kind of tragic. But here's the thing. We got life fruit. Uh, sorry, we got Spelunka. So it's not necessarily like we need to see anything but life fruit. But we'll just be marching on trying to gather that. Um, this is a fairly boring intro in terms of the action. So I'll pad it out a little bit with some stories. Today, I have been running around doing some last minute house stuff. Because as you all know, we get the keys tomorrow. So today, I did um, a recycling center job. So I went to the recycling center. Got some stuff recycled, which is good. Happy about that. A little less chaos in the house. Uh, and then I went and bought some like new smart home appliances, uh, mainly security cameras. I bought a bunch of security cameras. I also bought like new locks and stuff for the for the guard. Oh my god, really? So <laughs> this is tragic. What a what a poor attempt today to get some life fruit. Look, I'm gonna need it for Mirage. I ain't gonna survive. But yeah, I just ran around. I I got a new drill because I needed a new drill. But yeah, top priority is. Security, that's right. Um, lots of security. I even got um, a new little... <laughs> this is going to be funny. Because I know some people are paranoid about like smart home stuff. So I, I paired this with the word security. And some people are going to be like, what? <laughs> but I got a new um, big Google thing with a screen. Which is cool. Because I had a Google thing with a screen. But it's quite small. And it's off in the kitchen. But it's cool because that also has a security camera in it. Which once again, some people are going to be like, nah. <laughs> Google are watching. Trust me, um, I don't care. <laughs> My paychecks come from Google. I'll be all right. <laughs> they probably probably know too much about me already. Um, all right, hopefully we find some... Hey, life fruit, there you go. Speak of the devil, and life fruit shall appear. Very nice. 
yeah, we're just going to be mooching about, grabbing life fruit, um, and then we'll do Mirage. So apparently, according to you lot, Mirage can be spawned in the desert on the surface. But you had your theories that because it was a hallowed desert, that is why I didn't uh, see anything. I would agree. I would say that probably makes sense. Probably does. So, um, so yeah. Uh, I'll probably stick to the same tactic where we go kind of below the surface a little bit and kind of mooch about a little bit and see what happens. What is attacking me now? A bee, really? Go away. <laughs> Sick of you bees. So one thing I am happy about is uh, is Court got a text today to say that the, the new internet router has been delivered at the new house. So I don't know who took the package. Probably like somebody like either the neighbors that have moved in or they've like slotted it through the letterbox or whatever. But it's good because that does mean uh, that we will have internet. That is actually confirmed because it is something I have been super paranoid about. Like I, I, I think I mentioned it yesterday that we're getting internet for the, the right day. But I didn't know until I got the router, mainly because I want to use their router because I've, I've, it came with the internet package. Um, and then also, because I use a router now from um, from like Sky in Britain, it's alright, it's not bad. It's not, um, it's not amazing, don't get me wrong. But the, the thing is, when you, when you finish internet with one company, you have to send back the router. And I've been thinking about why they're so adamant on you sending back the router rather than you owning it. And I think I know why. I think it's because back in the day, I'm fairly certain people used to like rig boxes and stuff to kind of work in their favor. I'm fairly certain that's what used to happen. Not like I'm condoning that. I don't think people would ever do it anymore. But yeah, so, so I don't have a router in a week, so I'm glad I got it. All right, <laughs> long story short, internet will be available from tomorrow. So I'm probably just gonna go and settle my new office and just work from there. Before I've even moved in, I'll just go around and record. I think it's a nice way. Good to look after the house as well. Right, so um, we died once again. So i tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to fight Mirage. <laughs> I'm not going to bother with life through. I'll be all right. Or I think I might be all right. We'll figure it out together. Okay, so here's what I will do. So yesterday I asked for some general advice um, for the fight. And I'll be honest, I didn't really get too much of it. And I think it's because, and this, this usually happens on mods that that not everyone has played people don't really have advice for them um because they haven't played them which is fine but the only thing i got was somebody just said you can't go wrong with the bow that you've got so somebody was like use the bow that you've got and maybe pair it with um some chlorophyte arrows instead um and i think that's a good idea so we'll do that right so let's dip dive dodge down to the little base down below uh slap all that kind of garbage in there and then make some chlorify arrows for oh my god i didn't mean to make that many oh no can you even make a magic quiver out of these oh you can't oh yeah because we're not using all the extra mods and stuff whenever i said that last time people are like ah james what you do is you do all these little you get all these extra mods to do it I'm not, I'm only, the, the only reason I'm not doing that is mainly because I just want to play pure modded for this mod. I'm kind of like adamant on that sometimes. It's weird because I feel like I don't need to be. Right, so let's, let's try this out. So the benefit of this is, whoa, oh, that is good. Wow. Okay, I was not expecting that. So it does have the same properties as what we had before, which is amazing. That's really cool. I mean, that's really, really good. So you get the same properties, and you get the added bonus of the fact that each arrow is going to deal slightly more damage, because this is 25, and these are 8. Now, they're changing a little bit, as you can see. Well, they were changing uh, because of movement speed. So just keep that in mind. Right, let's, um, let's linger down around here. And see if we can get um, Mirage's little thing to, to spawn in. Because I wanted to try and spawn in over here again. So I'm not too sure whereabouts I need to go. I can't remember where we were last time as we got it to spawn in. I think I would have been just around here. But yeah, that, that is clearly better than, than what we had before. But now we just need it to spawn in. Ooh, okay, there we go. So it has spawned in over here. So what we're going to do is we're going to try do what we did last time where we make a path on the way there. Okay, let's see this. Oh, God. 
Okay, right. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Oh, there it is. Oh, God, I love it so much. I love it so much. I really, really just want... <laughs> it's very selfish of me, but I just want more and more people to, to find this Let's Play. Because I feel like this is so, so different. Like, it's, it's a different mod. Do you know what I mean? Uh, to be fair, though, I think all the, the mods we cover on this channel are really good. I've been lucky in that sense. <laughs> but yeah. All right. Okay, Mirage. Let's blow up this part. And then we'll blow up this part. I love the, the block. Oh my god, it looks really nice. I keep thinking it's like regular sand. But this block looks really cool. Okay, right. So, challenge. There we go. Right, Mirage has spawned in. So, just like before, we're going to try and take it to the surface, which we have successfully done. The music is very loud, so I might be shouty for a couple of minutes. I apologize. But it's actually all right. Oh, wow. So, I tell you what, when you get the chance to deal damage, you get to do a good amount of damage, mainly because of the fact that it's um, it stays pretty stationary. So, as you can see, I haven't made any kind of arena for this. I'm just kind of winging it. And I don't think winging it is necessarily working. Let's be real here. Like, our... We, we're taking too much damage. We're taking too much damage. I think we might need to move over, actually, to Chlorify Armor. I think that's where I'm going wrong. I'll be honest. There was a part of me that thought I could kind of wing my way through that fight. Uh, but I don't think that's going to be the case. I think it is going to be a case of, like, all right, you need to, to go and take it seriously. So what we'll do then is we will go back to the jungle and I will go look for, for more life fruit. I think that'll be step number one. We'll also grab Chlorophyte as well. And yeah, I think we'll make um, a Chlorophyte set and kind of go from there. Because I don't think... <laughs> so I've missed Spirit again. I just want to give her a burger. Oh, there she's back again. I don't have a burger. I'm so sorry. Um, Sorry, I've lost my train of thought. <laughs> I'll be honest. Ooh... So we just got a Star Cloak. Now, earlier we got the uh, the Cross Necklace. So I might actually end up combining those. Mainly because I really do like um, that extra uh, invincibility. I think I just remembered my train of thought. I was I was going to say that, um, that we weren't taking damage necessarily setting up the fight. As in bringing it to the surface. It really was like all um, post bringing it uh, to the surface. So it, it's a, a classic case of we need to get better at dodging. I think it's also a pretty it's a pretty distracting weapon, to be honest. So I might eventually swap it out. I don't know. Right. So um, let's make some chlorophyne. That's not enough. Wow. I was grabbing like... I guess it's because we made so many arrows, isn't it? All right. Okay. Kind of screwed myself over a little bit there. Right. I'm going to have to go back and grab some more. But yeah, tell you what. I will make the... Um, oh, what's it called? Star Cloak Veil? Veil? I can't remember the name of it. What? Okay, right. Let's have a little look. No, show me, show me the ones I can craft. Let's see here. Um, Star Veil. All right. I don't know why in my head I was like, nah, this isn't it. <laughs> I was like looking at it like, like this for like something to do with jellyfish. Or something like that. All right. Okay, um, swap that over. Actually, swap that over. And I think we're already a little bit better off than what we were before. All right. Oh, I love these hats. Oh, wow. Which one should we make? Um, did we end up... I can't remember. Did we ever end up making the cellar armor? I don't think we did, did we? I'm going to make... Um, ooh, I'm, I'm going to make a pink one. Because I think it's going to look really good in the thumbnail. Let me have a little look at this. Oh, it does look pretty bright and vibrant. But it also looks pretty awful. <laughs> I love wizard hats, though. I really do. I just, I don't know. They look great, don't they? Uh, do we blend in? I mean, Geroid or whatever his name is. I, I like it. I dig it. Big fan. Right. So, we can make uh, leggings now. And we'll also make uh, a ranger helmet there we go bam 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 so i don't really know if that's any better 45 and 40 wait <laughs> yeah 45 and 45 all right it is what it is all right it is what it is also i don't really seem to be finding any life fruit i feel like um my world is like nah 
do it without. So, hmm, what do we do? I almost feel like I want to go down and try and uh, get a reforge on some of our armor. So I think the NPC that does the armor reforging, he only comes by randomly. So we'll, we'll give that a go and we'll see how far we get with that. Because that would be quite nice. Like if we can get some defensive uh, buffs or maybe even just like putting up attack. I mean, it's kind of like, it, it, it is almost like a free buff really because of the fact that... um. We still got to pay for it, but in regular old Terraria, you wouldn't necessarily have it. I think one big thing as well is we we need to make some kind of um some kind of arena really. So I'm just gonna mooch about. All right, there he is. He's already spawned in. Where's he at? <laughs> I cannot see him. Oh, he's over here. All right, we'll have to mine to him. I forgot to um to grab the other weapons, but I feel like the weapon we've got right now is is legitimately probably gonna be the best one. I mean, I do not know for certain, but it seems that way. All right, once again, if I seem like I'm shouting, by the way, the music is so loud. <laughs> for you lot, it'll be all right, because I'm going to edit it down. But yeah, for me, it's oh, it's unbearable. <laughs> no, it's not really. It's, it's really nice music, but oh my god. Oh god, there's so many enemies around here. No way we survived this. <laughs> not a chance. There's just too many. Come on, mate. Vulcan, please kill something. Oh, God. All right. I've been webbed. All right. Quick. Reforge. Uh, helmet. All right. It's shiny. That's a pretty good buff, actually. Increase length of invi- Oh, I'll take that as well. All right. What's this one? Increase movement speed. Now, we'll give that a second. No, we can't afford it. All right. Okay, cool. I would say, honestly, that was kind of worth it. I think we can all agree on that. I'll tell you what as well. I'll make a... Um, I'll make a spider staff in a second. Right, okay, let's go back. <laughs> it's so loud. The music is good, though. It is good. Right, so, um, here's the thing. Where's the... All right, the dryad's here. Let me spend a little bit of moolah, because I want to get some, some platinum boxes, because I want to do a nice little bridge over the desert. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to make the spider staff. We've already got new... Oh, God, we're running out of arrows as well. This this kind of ain't great. What are these? Tracing arrows. Hmm. Now, we'll, we'll make some more of these. All right. There we go. Okay. So we, so we got some more of those. Um, What was I meant to do? Oh, yeah. Sp thank spider summit. Spider or staff. Oh, I can't actually make one. All right. Oh, I can make an optic staff, though. I, I may as well make it. I mean, why not? Do I still have my bewitching table? Oh, I do. Yeah. All right, it's a little bit of extra damage. Okay, what was the other thing? All right, we're, we're going to go build an arena. All right, I'm going to get on it. <laughs> Ooh, so it has actually spawned on the, the surface this time. Oh, we haven't got any health potions. Oh, that's so annoying. All right, I'll, I'll give it one go without health potions, and we'll see how it goes. All right, that's as much summoning as we're going to get. And begin. All right, let's see how we do. I don't know if it's going to soak up all my... The summoning damage is going to affect me all that much. We'll see. So I definitely need to get better at dodging this fight. There's a lot to, to kind of contend with here. So my plan is to just move around left and right and see if I can start actually avoiding some of the, the hits that it fires my way. Tell you what, it takes its, um, it takes its sweet time kicking out some of these attacks, doesn't it? I don't know if you've noticed, but it's not really attacking us. So I'm assuming that there's probably a, a second half, maybe? Or maybe, nah, maybe when it's distracted, it doesn't want to fire on you. Or maybe just when it hits, it hits hard. I'm like frantically pushing the, the health button, which is so funny because like we can't actually do anything. I love how the fight is like chucking out some lucky charms at us. No, thank you. Uh, I do not need that in my life. <laughs> Okay, right. What's it chucking? Is it chucking out, like, the suits on uh, on playing cards? Okay, right. Oh! So we're actually doing alright, considering I can't heal today. <laughs> like, you would think we'd be doing a lot worse. Alright, let's see, though, when it starts kicking out some, some more attacks, though. Okay, right. Just keep avoiding it. So I don't know, did it did it heal up at a certain point? Because I feel like it's got way more health than it had before. I'm assuming it did. 
So now that's a big thing. Don't take don't take contact damage from it. <laughs> Especially if you can avoid it. Because contact damage does a lot. Oh my god, look at that. Alright, I'm really struggling to avoid the... Um... Oh no, we get hit by a star. Oh no. Okay, right. Yeah, we, we came very close. I would say... I would say we came close if... If that was the final part of the fight. I think for, for not healing... That wasn't bad, was it? That was not bad. I'm going to try it again. <laughs> I am. I'm going to try it again. Right. I'll tell you what, though. Uh, we do need to grab more buffs. So let's pray we have enough moolah to keep buying buffs. Because we did just spend a lot of money on reforges. Now, is it you that sells... Oh, you do. You sell big boy healing pots. Okay. Yeah, I, I, think, I think if that is it... I think we might have we might have figured out how to do this fight. So that's pretty good. <laughs> Not bad for a Tuesday. Not bad for a Tuesday. I thought we'd get stuck on this fight for, for absolutely ages. What is actually after Mirage? God, it's Plantera. Plantera than Insurgent. Ooh. It's kind of sad to say, but we don't really have that long left in the mod. I don't think we do. Okay, right. So it has spawned in again. Uh, so we're going to buff up. We're going to wait here for a second so that we can uh, so that we can get all healed up. Don't worry about it. We'll chill. Um, it's fine. Have we got as many as we need? Yep, we got four. Or is that six? One, two, uh, six. <laughs> Forgive my counting skills. All right, come on. Go on, get up to... Oh, I didn't take a... Oh, no, I did. Did I take life force? Yeah, I must have. I must have. All right. Okay. Begin. All right. So let's do better this time. Let's do better. So what did we learn? We learned that we need to avoid these. We need to not take contact damage, if possible. We know that we need to avoid these. Honestly, I'm feeling a lot better about this one. I am. Oh, that's cool. So you can see that Mirage has around her all of the different mirrors that we've seen. That's pretty unique. I like that. Okay, now we're seeing arrows. So I wonder if if she maybe just picks her attack based on the, the mirrors, maybe. She's like, oh, it's time for this mirror. Do you know what I mean? That's like why we got arrows at a certain point, for example. This is a hard one because we've got to keep a good level of focus here. But it's like, I feel like I lost a little bit of focus only because we just did the fight. Do you know what I mean? Knowing that it likely heals up as well is kind of rough. <laughs> okay, so as you can see, we've, we've got a lot less uh, health in this one. We're taking a lot more uh, of these hits. I'm not exactly sure what's hitting me, I'll be honest. Like, I don't know why my health is so low. It might be that in this fight, you get kind of a... Uh, you might get poisoned. That might be it. Okay, I'm just being careful though. Seven seconds left on a heal. Okay, Mirage, please get out of the way. Please do not hit me anymore. Uh, I do not want to die to this attack. Okay, so now it's these arrows again. And I really do struggle with these arrows. Okay, so I did I did get a... Oh, I did get a heal in, but we took contact damage, which really isn't great. Okay, let's just keep letting it move about. Okay, it's sending out the clubs. Let's not get in the way. So I'm assuming, yeah, it's healed now, hasn't it? It's hard because I'm not exactly, like, keeping a strong eye on its health. I'm just kind of winging it a little bit. So when it heals and stuff, I don't really tell. I just kind of assume. I'm like, well, it's been a little while. I really hope the, the arrow attack doesn't come back because that, that one is kind of hard to dodge. All right. Mirage is scooting about right now. She's scooting. Oh, God. Wow, she got me again. God, that was actually honestly really hard. <laughs> so I think for today, we might actually uh, wrap it up there. That was really cool. I had a, I had a good episode today. I think that was fun. We got um, a little bit of life fruit, kind of. We made some new armor. We had some good attempts. We learned. We improved. We evolved. Yeah, I think that'll be it. So tomorrow, tomorrow is the big day. I'm hoping that I can get some recording done in the morning so that there won't be a, a break in content, hopefully. But yeah, um, I, 
God, I'm so excited. I am, I am actually genuinely like well over the moon. I guess I'll talk more about it tomorrow because uh, we're not going to go see it until half four because Courtney's working tomorrow. And, you know, we want to go in together to our little home, you know? Wow. I can't believe it. Do you think I'll sleep tonight? That's all I want to know. I'll let you know tomorrow. But I don't think I'm going to sleep very well. I think I'm going to be like um, a kid on Christmas. Do you know what I mean? Wow. All right. See you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, but that's it from me. Um, shout out to channel members as always. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Peace.